to a rescue in the middle of a marsh. Seven people had to be saved after an airboat overturned in Brevard County. It happened this morning on Lake Washington. Shortly after the crash, though, the captain of another airboat saved the day. News 6's James Barbero talks to the man who pulled the group to safety. The boat probably rolled, taking on water, and everybody just went out of the boat into the water. Seven distressed boaters calling on one lifesaver. I was at my shop and I got a phone call from the owner of the recreational boat. Captain Mike that Tipton is. of Bull Gator Adventures answering a call from a cell phone that stayed dry enough. Fifteen minutes later, he found the swimmer sitting atop the capsized boat in Lake Washington. One of my tour boats was on the water, but he was already had a full load on it. So I grabbed a boat, headed to the lake, got his cord found where he was, went and located him and uh, got him out of the water and on the, one of my vessels and back into a safe landing. Remarkably, none of the seven people on board were hurt. Yeah, I didn't see a scratch, a cut, or anything on anybody. Captain Mike says the owner is local and everyone on board was between 40 to 60. He thinks speed was not the problem. His guess is that the 16 or 17 footer was too heavy. I think it was a matter of the center of gravity of the boat was offset by the number and weight of the people that was on the hull. If it weren't for Captain Mike, he says the FWC or the Sheriff's Office would have rescued the boaters. Do you feel like the hero of Melbourne today? No, not at all. No, I just did what I would hope somebody would do for me if I was in the same situation. We asked how long the boat will remain in the water, and after speaking with the owner, Captain Mike tells us he believes it will be removed soon. It can be seen leaking fuel right now. In Melbourne, I'm James Sparvero, News 6.